online everybody we just received the box from Lenovo and now I'm gonna unbox it and show you what's all in there so you have an idea what to expect <laughs> So first of all, I received uh, two boxes actually. The first one is a small box. And it's quite obvious. It's, uh, there is probably a keyboard inside. And this is the big box that it's all about. But I'm gonna sh share with you how everything goes with unboxing all of this. So I'm quite excited. But, um, let's see how it goes, what it looks like. And just to make sure I hear also on the side, I put already a mat to put the monitor on it or just to keep everything in one piece. So because we don't want to break anything. So um, let's go further. And always make sure that on both sides that you also um, also remove the tape because sometimes it's been taped all the way around so it's quite um, difficult to open it up but I see here is a quite decent keyboard it looks good and it's an USB cable so I'm gonna put that aside put it here get rid of the box and next one we're gonna open this big thing here and always make sure that everything is taped when you receive it at your home or your address so you make sure that uh, it's not being tampered with so what we have here this is a power port if I'm not mistaken and I also received an Ethernet cable to connect to the internet not through Wi-Fi but directly on the router itself I also have a mouse here with an USB connector and here I have some more cables this is for the power unit and this one is the other end the adapter also looks good and here we see is the disc this is the the disc where we're gonna place the monitor on with the arm which you will see here as well put this aside and you don't need, don't need the screwdriver uh, because you can install it we're gonna use that in a moment and here I see it's the monitor arm that should have done quite good and that's a good thing because you don't want any uh, scratches on it it's adjustable on multiple heights just that I'm gonna use it on the disc that we had here earlier and the next one is more cables ah, this is the headset that I retrieved as well I'm gonna use it for uh, my work it's a decent headset good quality from the brand Jabra and let's slowly remove ports and here we have the monitor itself and with this monitor I also um, got the CPU unit as well they already put it inside here so uh, but you can also use this monitor separately as just as a monitor and using another CPU as well but in this case I used my um, I also um, ordered um, including the CPU unit itself so before we take it out, um, the nice thing to notice here is we're gonna put directly because it's still nice in the box. We're gonna put the arm also on it, and by doing it, so we just make sure which you see here, uh, 
two clamps here on top that had to be on the this side and the other one will automatically click in into the system so we're gonna do that until you hear a click there it is and now you can slowly remove the monitor from its holding position so you make sure that you don't create any damages and here it is and I will also show you uh, put it on the plateau here on the circle and I'm gonna help you with it and we'll see you in the video soon see here the monitor I just still keep it in the box because um, I want to guide you so the easiest way how to uh, attach everything on it but you see here they have the monitor here and it's the back side of the monitor I already put the the extension arm here on it why you can also release it by just pressing this up and you can release the arm as well and to attach it you just put it there until you hear a click and that's it as you can see here the monitor is also can be um, adjusted horizontally and also vertically so that's a good thing and here you can already see a little bit of the um, um, the connectors, what you're going to be using, the, the output and the input, the USB, uh, HDMI, the power outlet as well. And what you see here, when you click this one, you're going to pop this up here. And here you will see that the unit has already been installed here, but you can uh, adjust it here and to make sure that the unit, the CPU unit, is connected firmly to the monitor itself because here on this side here you see a couple of connectors then it's already integrated into the monitor itself but we're gonna use it not later on and I'm just gonna close it for now this and on this side it's not easier to see but there's uh, other connectors here as well uh, two USB outputs uh, for your headset for a microphone and also the on and off button which i will show you later in this video now we're going to continue to put this on here you put you want to make sure that the pin is corresponding with the holes that you see here on the bottom we're going to do that want to make sure that it's on top of the holes itself this and we're just gonna do it tighten it so make sure that the monitor stays on the place on the arm so it doesn't wiggle in any way and that's it and then slowly when you re uh, remove it from the box itself that I have here you want to make sure that you uh, pull it out of the box as far as above near the monitor itself not on the bottom here so it's more stable to um, take it out so not from here from this side here but close to the monitor itself that's gonna do that now Thank you. 